wash systems, they begin with water. And one fundamental thing that we need to remember, water is nature's gift. We can clean water, we can use water, but we cannot produce water. It is only in nature. So any discussion on water and sanitation should begin also with understanding the voice of nature. And that is what makes water shape different. <laughs> The main aim of this program is to ensure that there is sustainable wash for all and one of the major pathways is uh, through social accountability where we are ensuring that the people are aware so we are relying on civic engagement so that there is improved service delivery that is informed by the people. Uh, we didn't know about public participation, we didn't know much about uh, budgeting, women didn't know anything to do with the government indeed. Watershed has taught us so much, eh? has pushed, not really teaching, but pushing, pushing us. You are supposed to do this. They give us information. You see, information is the key to everything. কার কোনানে সিনেটারি লেটিন নাই কার কোন জায়গায় কর লাগবো কে কি সুবিধা কার কি অসুবিধা আছে যায় হেগো কি কি সমস্যা আছে না আছে এটা জানি যে এগুলো নির্দেশ দেই যে তোমরা দরখাস্ত করো দরখাস্তের মাধ্যমে দেই চাই কি করা যায় কে কিভাবে কত বড় বড় সদস্য বানায় নিয়ে আইছি বেদিনী গো আছে একজন কই নু শিখতে পেরেছি জানি আমরা সরকারের কাছে সব তুলে ধরতে পারি তাতে হেরার লাগে আমি জড়িত হয়েছি নাগরিক কমিটির সদস্য হয়েছি কমিটির মেম্বার ওই আর সদস্যের মেম্বার ওই আমি আবেদন করেছি একটা টিউব কলের টিউব কল পেয়েছি আর পরে একটা টয়লেটের আবেদন করছি আবার এটা পাই নাই টিউব কল লাগানোর পর সবাই বলছে যে আপনার কারণে এই টিউব কলটাই জায়গায় আসছে আমরা কত বছর বেরি করছি এই মেম্বার স্যার মানে এত সুবারাশি করছে কত ভালো ভালো লোক কেউ একটা টিউব কল আনতে পারে নেই তো আপনি নাগরিক কমিটির মেম্বার হইয়া তো আপনি একটা টিউব কল আমাকে বেরির ভিতরে আনাইছে সেই আপনি রুচিলে আমরা সবাই পানি খেতে পারছি So uh, for the watershed uh, India team I think uh, the biggest satisfaction we have is uh, making our watershed communities water literate so that they understand the linkages between the natural ecosystems and the functioning of toilets and water systems in the bathroom and kitchens but they are also able to engage in the planning and decision making processes at the scale when it makes sense for the wetland as well as their houses So water literate communities water aware communities are able to understand that water comes from some place water goes to some place where it goes to some place and the system itself needs to be managed to keep sure that water systems are sustainable over long in mali context uh, we found that uh, uh, many actors were working in silos So we have created a multi stakeholder forum for uh, all the actors uh, to come together and uh, discuss issues uh, related to wash and IWRM in the country through dialogue and sharing experience best practice and planning joint planning This is uh, the only river that is in this area where everyone is feeding on. 
our old grand fathers said this river should be protected for them they protected it it is us the, the grandchildren that are destroying it We have not been doing much on protecting River Mpang until when we got the capacity from Hewasa to advocate for the management of River Mpang and the restoration of River Mpang. So it's very important to partner with everybody to come on board and be able to understand why we should protect River Mpanga and be able to use it for our life here. Uh, the kind of approach that we do is basically to lobby and advocate. We engage with the leaders, we engage with the local authorities, and then we empower the local communities. With the support of the stakeholders, especially the watershed program, has helped us to like come up with some, some policies, come up with bylaws. And the bylaws have stopped story querying along the river banks. So those who are working there, cracking stones, getting the sand, we are sensitized them, and as I speak now, they have moved away from the river. They are looking for stones elsewhere. So the community will benefit getting good water, and the river Mpango will be protected from being polluted. So that's the balance, actually, that where we are moving. So as Watershed in Ghana, what we have done to try to bridge the gap is to work with citizens um, within the local communities, identified advocates, provided capacity building training, and we continue to work with them to prepare them and to ensure that they are able to engage in the town hall meetings with government and other stakeholders and get their voices heard. Besides the work with the community, we also uh, do uh, advocacy initiatives, act activities with the local government departments and institutions. Starting the whole Pudan Udduk Tai Silo Yandira, Yandira. The era of the government direction of the Asi, in the Shirakago Zibo Tri Thakta, practically Silon. In the era in Kore, practically Amadir Dara Bang Zonogonke Udduk Koresi. তাতে আমাদের ইউনিয়ন কাউন্সিলে বিভিন্ন কাজের যে বাজেট এখানে বড় বাজেট আছে আমাদের দেয়া যা আগামীতে আমাদের আরো কত সবকটা ইউনিয়নকে এই ভোলা সদর উপজেলার সবটা সবকটা ইউনিয়ন আমরা কাজ করব এবং আমাদের প্রত্যেককে নিয়ে আমরা একত্র হইয়া আমরা আমাদের অগ্রগতিটা একখানে তুলে ধরব ইফ ইউ শেয়ার দিওর ডিমান্ড মোর স্ট্রাকচারড ওয়ে ইন এ uh, meetings uh, that you, you can be a, uh, you can be a member of that uh, decision making we have recently uh, produced the popular version of the public participation act which is now simpler and easy for the common citizen to read and go through. So we even go further to produce a citizen's budget. We as taxpayers, we don't know how much is allocated to us on the side of the water sector. But when you share these documents with the members, everybody will be wary and even our leaders will be scared because they know whatever they are doing is a privy to, to the community. Inclusion means that we should be in every meeting, in every board, in everything concerning the government or the county. And now we are in full swing, trying to see that in, when it comes to water issues, persons with disabilities are in the front line. I have committee the I am a very good person. 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 I am
and also focusing on water. Like well, if I see the people we've been interacting with actively, you know, participating in these processes and, you know, meaningfully engaging even government, it of course makes me feel good because in essence that is what Watershed is all about in making sure that everyone has access to uh, safe uh, water services. We are saying that it includes everyone, including the very marginalized of the people. Yeah, so it's, it's quite important that they are now uh, actively coming up to advocate for their own rights. And that, of course, is a step towards achieving sustainable water. I remember one time when we had Charles has obsessed in our people.